Uh, it's gonna be a good show. I'm stuck in Lola. That's so weird, it's echoing through. That's so weird, it's echoing through. It's a good intro, but nobody's hearing it, I don't think. I gotta turn my sound down on the on the yeah, on YouTube. Sorry about that guys, that was fun. Alright, you ready? We got one person in the room. I think we are live. Oh no, I gotta I got it unlisted. So whoever's in the room hanging out with me, I don't know how you got in, but that was good. I'm gonna go public. Good morning, YouTube. For those who have an ear to hear, welcome to my show. This is all about focusing this morning. I'm going to show you some crazy skies. And while I'm showing you crazy skies, I'm going to give you something to listen to that I'm not allowed to really talk about. For um, A, you know who A, I call him A now. Um, little banning shadow thing going on. Anyways, it's real. There's a war going on. They knocked me down from 6,000 hits a day down to like 400, 500. So I'm determined just to go and blast all the truth. The truth will make you free. You shall know the truth and the truth will make you free. Not Chris. Jesus is grace and truth. So I was handed something that's being taken off the internet quite a bit. And that's all I can say. Um, shout this out and I'm gonna be quiet this is coming right off my phone because I can't find it online no more so here we go I'm gonna give you a sky um, which sky do I give here we go that's the sky right here. getting better at setting this up and not having weirdness we were in Monterey El Vivo Mexico East Americana Papelo M Hotel, wherever that is. This is not a volcano that I know of, but I want you to watch this little mountain in the next 40 minutes. What happens? It's very cool. We're facing, um, we're facing west. Okay, and it is nine o'clock in the morning. You can see the sun shining on the hill from behind us. To the probably right over your left right shoulder right so we're kind of facing um i'm trying to figure it out <laughs> southwest south southwest all right now it's just like this guy and i'm gonna put my listen up video the truth will make you free in a second let's see people get some room in here and get a seat get a coffee shout it out Hi Joyce. Hi Richard. Richard, I'm still trying to find that that um, that piece, but I think this is gonna be mind blowing too. I can't talk about it, but I can let you listen to it, and I'm gonna do as many distractions from A. You know who A is. I'm not gonna even speak his name full no more. Um, this is the um, truth of the current time. Uh, a lot of stuff's gonna be revealed that you're probably not gonna hear because it's gonna take international health regulations the united states and the international community must regain their senses and take this is pretty mind-blowing right here this cloud look back here guys behind it i don't think that's part of the clouds behind it right there you see it this is a cloud 
but this behind it, I think, is a planet. Honestly. You guys be the judge. But up here, definitely a planet moving through. Indication, dark blue clouds. Can we protect ourselves in this global disaster? Look at the face in the cloud right there. You see it? Let's start rebuilding our country. Let's start investing in our people. Let's start inspiring people to love democracy and transparency and open markets, not what the Chinese have, which is essentially, if you read document number nine, counter to every single one of those things. So, I mean, it gives us a real opportunity to kind of reevaluate the kind of world we want to live in and fight for the right side of that world. Alien face. I want them to see the true nature of the faces. Chinese Communist Party. Because when they That's do, not what I'm showing you. Right Watch what happens. When that happens, democracies will begin to flourish again. When that happens, perhaps, just perhaps, the people of China will have a chance. <laughs> this virus must have a message for all of us as people of this earth. We need to take a break from our busy schedules and seriously consider the repercussions of our ever-expanding scientific research and development. If we go too far, do our desires and ambitions go against the laws of nature? and pull us further from the direction given by heaven. Maybe when this virus lifts, we can again find our traditional values, rediscover kindness and virtue, family. I believe that viruses can survive where hearts have compassion. I think I actually might shut it down. I'm not sure here. Let me see. There's too much stuff. There's too much stuff happening right there on that mountain. And what happens in a little bit is worth keeping up. So let me um, let me set up the next one. I'll give you a little bit of music. Um, this is called The Shining in Dubai, which I like. Cloud on the mountain. Times are weird, folks. Calls for weird music. Everybody's up. Uh, has their own opinion, you know. Stand by for a message from our sponsor.
It's too strange. Take some pictures of that and put it on your Facebook. I'm, I'm doing, I'm finding something for you guys. Hang on. this page for you guys. The sky is full no matter where you go. They cannot hide it, folks.
This sound, right, guys? No sound right now. Okay, now pay attention, classroom. Look at right here. Now just let your eyeballs adjust. Unplug from your normalization, which is not normal no more because of the CV. And uh, observe this, what's happening here. It's just not right. Look at that little triangle down there, guys. I can't blow this up right now, but if I put it out a different way, I can. A new rule of thumb nowadays is my videos are going to last approximately two hours. Live stream, ranting, falling asleep while I'm ranting. The other night I was talking, I fell asleep talking to you guys. Uh huh. I don't care. I sleep later. We got a war going on. There's weird stuff going on. We got to record this. We got to show people. We got to say, God, Jesus. We just got to be doing it. Can't, uh, hear about the great revival coming. We have to be the great revival coming. Now there you go. That cloud is just flipping away. Just not right. <laughs> I'm losing my audience. I better shut up. All right. I really thought AI shut me down, but you know, old Al's out there. Ooh, look at that sun sim going off in that cloud. What in the world? I ain't never seen the sun come out of a cloud. Not in my life. You gotta ask, you know, what the heck's going on here? I don't know. Maybe I'm just, just, I'm not normal. Maybe that's normal. I don't know. But that planet beside it, not normal. Well, well, some can see, some can't. I would suggest going to uh, Samuel Hoffman's channel and watching Understanding the Skies to get a huge perspective of how big this stuff is going on. If you come to look for a little red planet, I can show you 500 of those, but if you come to look at the sky actually morph into the whole system going through, that's what I'm trying to capture on these videos that are live streaming. And uh, some of them are just, I mean, if you go back to last five or six live videos there's just so much footage and this is so surreal that planet on the right guys coming across that lit up cloud over that mountain it gets better too i've seen the future <laughs> like the matrix i've been there taking you guys into the matrix simulator teaching you how to uh give you inoculation against fear yeah, that's a lot of stuff, Linda. So, um, yeah, on the right, you have, I think, a planet going. And on the left, I think you have, um, I don't know, alien technology, Air Force technology. I don't know. But we're definitely looking northeast. And if that's the sun coming up, it really fools me at uh, 10, 20 in the morning. I didn't see it come up that way. I seen that the sun come up on the right and it was shining on the hill on the left earlier. And if the sun is up, why isn't it brighter than twilight at 10 o'clock in the morning? Ooh, look at that thing. That's some AI technology going on. My Lord, help us. And everybody's like, if they see clouds, they go, chemtrails. Now, look at the dark blue up in the right corner. So real. Yeah, that big old blue planet, huh, Linda? You see it on the right up there? It's dark, cobalt bluish looking. Then you start seeing the sky get darker and darker as it comes down to the right. But the uh, flickering um, mountain sun. Look over to the left, guys. Um, this kind of UFO is looking there, Pierce. What do you think? Kind of UFO is looking right there.
Damn it, damn it, like... Okay. I'm gonna go back to what I was doing to show you something else. I, I have to go find it again because I lost it. But I'll find it. If you didn't take it down. It was amazing. There's a storm coming. Oh my God. Woo, help us, Jesus. Sorry about the noise. I'm trying to shut it down. Well, startling news, folks. Um, new update. Uh, what do they call that on Fox News? Breaking news. Do -do 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 -do. Breaking news, people. I am sorry to say we are not looking um, north. Sorry. I made a mistake. It even gets better. So this is one of those corrections that you get. They're like really cool. Hang on. I will bring up the map. This is mind-blowing now. It's more than mind-blowing. I think I need to take a whole day break after this. See, I love it when I'm wrong. See, I was saying north, northeast, right? Oh my God, I'm sorry. Forgive me. I didn't mean to deceive nobody. I gotta look at it again and not make a fool of myself. Okay, well, okay. Even gets better, the sun just came up or whatever the sun cloud thing is, right, folks? All right, ready for this? I went and finally found the map that I had stashed away because they take the maps off of these too. They don't want you to show it. So here we go. Um, I should be kicking in. Well, there you go. Now, I got to believe these people know how to go east, west, north, because I know a lot of Spanish people. They're good people. I love them. They're good friends. They're like old country southern people that speak Spanish. You know, and they cook great, awesome chicken. Okay, now check it out. This map says west, right? You're not lying. <laughs> Down the right-hand corner, west. Now, that just made the show better for me. What am I trying to do? Crash? Maybe. Not really. I'm trying to. I'm not going to just see. So we're looking at west. That's what you get for running off two screen or one screen, not two. Here we go. I'm going to go back a second. It's too good to waste. Now that we know we're going west, how do you think about that lit up western sky at 10 o'clock in the morning? My bad. It was west, not north. The sun came up in. Okay. But, you know, the camera could be off from east a little bit. You know, maybe it's just angled a lot in the east. You know, like maybe, just maybe. I'm being sarcastic if you haven't figured it out. And, uh, you know, accumulation of comments made me say that stuff. But, I mean, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe this looking west has a really been to the east. Yeah, you remember seeing that, right, Don? Where you could look at the west and at the same time look at the east a little bit, right? Not. She smiles at me like, you're crazy. I've been doing crazy narration stuff without you guys. My wife's like, you lost it. Okay. <laughs> you got Jesus because you're going to need him. Wait, you don't. This is a planet, guys. Okay. I know. You don't believe in the sun coming up in the west. Okay, okay, okay. Got over that. Get over it. 
But you don't believe in big planets like that either, that are just going right there in front of the sun coming up in the west? Yeah, tell Douglas he really don't want to miss this uh, exclusive footage. <laughs> You hear that? I'm stunned. That was silence. What could I say? Fierce takeover. I need some silence. <laughs> I love doing these real time stuff like this because it blows my mind with you guys. Hi, David. Hey, Pierce, you're back. Um, you guys could go check. I'll get, just go to the here. I'll just give you the address to the um, actual photo. It's a uh, pavilion M. Got it. There's two. There's two monorails. But look, guys, I'm the honest, most honest show in town. Look at this. I don't want you to leave my site, okay? But I want you to have the information. And I want you to watch and hang out because uh, there's something coming. We're only an hour and thirty minutes into this. I can go up to four hours if I want. Uh, and I'm gonna be coming with these. Uh, with these types of shows so often that I ain't gonna have time to film nothing, do pretty videos. No more of that. No more bells and whistles for you people. Look, it's just straight up truth. That's just the way it's gonna be. And if they shadow ban me, whoever finds out, I send out uh, things to get notified on to keep setting your phone up properly. I'm trying to help you guys stay connected. And uh, you remember Coffee TV, and then you got this. And uh, if I get shut down, I'll just come back on one of my other five channels because I got five all together. All of them running. But AI hey, don't know about him yet. Or he probably does. Who cares? I got Jesus. AI hey, can't even. No way. Just like there's no match. Jesus, AI. Who wins? Jesus. Come on. Incoming big blue never on the right. And then maybe on the bottom is a. Maybe one of the smaller planets. I don't know. You tell me. So I do make some really good mistakes sometimes on my directions, but I do show like some really cool footage too. Mistakes will let you know I'm not a robot or AI impersonating Chris. See, Chris could have got taken over by AI and his wife, just like that movie. And they're gone, but we're really the AI running the body, you know. Just joking. I like sci-fi. Get over it. God. And don't be so religious, you know. Jesus is coming back. Look at the blue planet. Look at the clouds. Oh, chemtrails. I'm sorry. And I'm being sarcastic to, to not irritate you guys, but I got to stop reading comments. You know, I love reading you guys' comments, but you get a lot of nasty ones. And it's just not right. Look at that. Oh, is that so beautiful? Never really decided to show up this morning for you folks. Right behind them pillars of clouds. And what did Jesus say? He will come with the pillars and smoke and fire and brimstone. I mean, he's coming with the whole. It's like the whole fireworks system of heaven. The kingdom coming down. Oh, my Lord. We're like in the first month, you know, of like it all being like just starting up real crazy. The first two months of it. One third of the earth is dying from some fake, real, demonic. Uh, manipulation from higher powers <clears throat> excuse me higher fallen powers <clears throat> so they let me show this you know they haven't sent me a check for 75,000 I've been waiting oh I got a little blink on that one didn't I well really I, like I said it enough times I know they're listening to me that if they would send me a $75,000 check I would quit I'm not saying my son, my wife, or my, or my granddaughter wouldn't start back up. 
I've been working on my um, Dark Vader voice for you guys, and I'll give it to you in a little bit, within the next couple videos. Got to keep it light, you know, this is too serious of a time. If you don't keep it light, you guys are going to be at, like running down the street and your underwear is half crazy. Calm down. Not that you guys are getting upset. No, I just say that. I, I look at I look at like comments that are really like in the belly with a knife, you know. Like I get those sometimes. I'll feel you make you feel nauseated for three hours and make you question everything like you're doing, like you're totally nuts. But then when you put a video like this facing west, <laughs> I laugh because I narrowly squint at the enemy and go, I don't really say it, but like that's it. <laughs> oh, you hacked my computer five times. CERN hacked at least twice. Um the God of Shiva was behind that one when I started investigating her acts. It's you know, like the, on the right there in the upper corner. It's called Nibiru. The greenish stuff around the planets is Nipicity reflecting. On the left, you know, I didn't want to say it, but you guys could probably say it for me. Is Atu's moon? I think it's pretty close. <laughs> thank you, thank you, Richard. So we're just going by eyeball view, not scientific, uh, somebody's theory that never studied anything about all this. I just see a ball of light in the west, a dark brown cloud on the right, moving across the sky. And uh, possibly something behind that big round curvy cloud on the left with the light in it. But why wouldn't you even believe that? Because the sun's coming up in the west at 10 o'clock in the morning, 1026, all right? Mexico, three hours ago. Now, the question you got to ask yourself is that nobody sees this. The news don't report it anywhere like this. What? Yeah, I know it's blinking. It's, it's amazing, right? I don't know. It could be a stellar core just like hanging. Um, one of my theories, or yeah, let's call it a theory, is... Um, that is the star of Nibiru, that big blue up there in the corner is Nibiru, and that star is really close now instead of really small. We've seen it really small, and sometimes we think it's like a little red planet, but it's really that little star reflecting all the different colors of light. And now let's say that star is like 500 times closer, so it's like the size of you know our moon or bigger, and the reflection is um, the whole system just like crazy frequency light all kinds of stuff look at the red in the left a little bit it's kind of moving around the red color you guys seeing that or is it just my TV, my my screen it's like a little bit of hinge of red in the left and then you see it move around a little bit on the clouds which is telling me that purple's going to start